Hi there, my name is Vovka and welcome to my channel. Today I want to talk about a big project which I was requested two months ago. So the brand of the wedding dress is from Ukraine, Eva Landel, it's a beautiful brand, requested me to shoot for three days in Warsaw. So my task was to shoot 41 dress and the final product which the brand wanted to have, it was 41 vertical video for each dress and also one horizontal promo video. I want to start from the point that uh, the organization was just perfect. We had three days of shooting, so it was two studios. Each studio had three rooms. One of them was for preparation, one of them was for photographer and another one was for me, for videographer. So it was possible to shoot without losing the time because we also had three models. So one was working with photographer, one with me, and another one was getting ready with another dress and makeup and hairstyle. Also we had amazing gaffer from Poland, I will leave all the contacts below the video so you can check if you will have some campaigns or shootings in Warsaw, there will be the contacts of models, also gaffer. It was really beautiful to work separate from photographer because sometimes I, I had uh, projects where I was working together with photographer and it's not the same thing as you are working just for yourself, you are talking to model, you uh, ask them to do what you want and not just uh, waiting for photographer and after that you are talking to model. So again, I would like to say thank you to the brand because the organization was just amazing and I wish that in my future career every project will be organized like this one. So we can start from the location. As I said, we had three rooms. So photographer was working in one room and I was working in another one. The gaffer uh, had a lot of light, mostly it was Aperture 300D and also we were using a daylight but at some point it was really too harsh so we were using some diffusions also i was using two lights uh, one of them was bouncing to the wall to volume up the light all over the room and another one was with the softbox which was pointed to the model in a dress also we had the big re light 2.5 if i'm not mistaken we were using it uh, to recreate the sunlight because the day was cloudy and we have the big balcony so we made kind of fake light on the wall because i really like the shape of it and it made the image a lot more interesting yeah. mm -hmm. you done? So the shooting process was really not so hard because the models were professionals, everything was prepared just 100% and I was shooting mostly handheld and sometimes my camera was on the tripod.
so for each dress we need kind of 10 15 seconds of vertical video some close-ups and also the long shots of course every shooting day was starting from the coffee machine i'm really a big lover of coffee i need to have three or four cups during the day and when i'm shooting it can be even five or six cups well the shooting was not so creative and three days we were doing kind of the same things but maybe different poses and stuff so you have to put some music on uh, not to get bored and this is a really huge thing to have the uh, speaker and the music with you guys sorry for interruption i need just a few seconds i've noticed that 87 percent of you are watching this video without subscribing the channel if you really like what i'm doing if you really like this content and it's helpful just hit the subscribe button and it will really help my channel to grow and you will not miss the next videos and also I want to remind you that I have the Patreon channel where you can subscribe and download all my LUTs, all the backstages and raw videos, so the, everything will be below the video, so let's go on with the backstage. Also let's talk about the process of creating the promo video, it was horizontal, so I shoot a few shots horizontally. I prefer the classic music for bridal dresses because it's really matching and also I tried to add some creativity to this shot so I made the mask uh, to put the model in front of the brand name at the end of the video if you want to know how to work with mask you can find it wherever in YouTube I'm here not to talk about masks maybe in future tell me if you want such a video so it was really simple, I just tracked the brand name and for me it looks uh, really interesting. And also in one shot I had the rosette or how this thing is calling, rosetka, it's electricity thing. I think it's rosette, maybe I'm mistaken but I think you understand. So I've masked this place with rosette and just blur it a bit so now this shot looks uh, much better and you can't notice that something was there. And this was my experience with shooting the wedding dresses. It sounds really crazy 41 dress to shoot, but it was really simple, again, because beautiful organization of the brand. And uh, if you like this content, if it was helpful, you can put the like button, say something in comments, and see you in next videos.